One, two, three, go. Welcome back to another Vivian Tries. Today, by popular demand, we have da -da -da -da, the flippin' fantastic pancake. Everybody's been telling me to get my hands on this guy. Today, I'm gonna try it out with pancakes. Duh, it's made for pancakes, but this one should be easy. And I have two pans here. You know which ones? I have my red copper pan. I also have the organic pan that sucks face, but I brought it just to try it out. One of the pans we'll use to make the pancakes and one of the pans we'll use to make the eggs. I'm really excited. The reviews are shit on Amazon. Horrible, but everybody kept asking me this in the comments. I got it on Twitter. I got it on Facebook. Everybody was asking me to try this thing, so I thought, Okay, let's do it. But before we get started, I want to thank everybody once again who joined me on my live chat. So many of you guys joined. March 9th will be our next live stream. All right, let's get started with our test. All right, so that's the inside of the box. And I think it's like a silicone kind of thingy. Yeah, that's it. There are my instructions. This is pretty self-explanatory, really. I don't really need to read these instructions, right? I agree with me, you guys. I mean, I think the infomercial was enough instruction. Hey, it's not like cheapy, nice silicone. Okay, so there it is. It's pretty big. Here's this guy. Is it gonna fit in there? Oh, oh shit. It's, you, it's not gonna fit in there, guys. Look, it's too small. I didn't even think about that. So you're gonna have, is this, yeah. So you're gonna have to use a bigger pan. So I'm gonna have to use this guy because this was too small. I mean, <laughs> you guys know I love my copper pan. Okay, so put that one to the side. I just wanna see how this is gonna sit in here. Oh, mm, yeah, okay, perfect. So you need something like an 11 inch pan to use this guy. I really don't know why the reviews on Amazon are so bad. I mean, it looks pretty easy, right? I don't know. Let me get my water, make my pancakes, and then I will grab seven eggs, and we will make seven little pa pancakes, because these are like little pancakes, right? That's not like a big pancake. You're gonna have to stack them up. These are like little pancake sliders. What are they called? They're not called that. Aren't they called like, Silver dollar pancakes? Is that is that a thing? Did I just make that shit up? I might have made that up. Something like that though. Dun dun dun. Let's zoom in. Pan is hot. Just gonna put that guy in there. I think you wanna make sure that it's flat. It doesn't stay flat. The sides, these little flaps are a problem. I have a feeling that they are a problem. Pancake batter is ready to go. Are you guys ready? Because I'm ready. If you're ready, I'm ready. Everybody ready? Okay, I'm gonna start over here. Okay, I think that's good. Next one. See, this one's not flat. This one's not flat on the pan, so, oh shit, it's going underneath, guys. Okay, that one's a fail. Okay, let's make sure to get the middle one. I'm gonna run out of pancake mix. Oh, this one's not flat. Okay, we'll fix it in a second. Oh man, what a fail. It already failed and we haven't even flipped it yet. Let me hurry up so I can kind of hold it down. Okay, 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 okay. Oh, fuck. Okay. Oh no. See, I'm trying to hold it down so that it at least, oh shit. This is not the way it's supposed to work because in the commercial it didn't do that. See, look at it. It's all spewing out. This might work on a pancake griddle, but it is not gonna work in a pan unless you have like, this is a 12 inch pan. I think it's a 12 and a half inch pan. Flipping fantastic, take my advice. Take these damn flaps. I don't know. I don't know how you would fix this, but these. Oh man, look. I didn't overfill, why did it do that? You think it's ready for me to flip? Not yet. I don't know what the hell happened here. Ugh. It's like one big pancake. So much for the little slider things I said. I'm gonna flip it that way away from me. Oh, I hope this does not fall out from the bottom. Ready, hold your breath. Nanette, this is for you. One, two, three, go. Oh shit, I'm scared. <laughs> one, two, three, go. <gasps> flip it, oh. But wait, but it's not flat. What? That will never work. They don't look nothing like the ones in that infomercial. No, no. Oh, I just 
<laughs> I just moved my finger through that one. Okay, I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna say it's done. What do you guys think? I'm just gonna flip it like he does. Ready? One, two, three, go. Mm. What the hell is that? Mm. They're just stuck. It's just one giant pancake now. At least the middle one, right? I thought that one. No, they're all stuck together. <laughs> No wonder it had horrible reviews. It looks nothing like the infomercial. I'm so pissed. I guess we're not surprised, right? They're never gonna pop out like the infomercial. Look at that, guys. Look, does this look like the beautiful little pancakes that you saw in the infomercial? Not one, not one came out perfect. Look, one giant pancake. I have my seven eggs here. They're cracking, crack a lack. <gasps> Oh, I feel like I have to like rush. Oh, I already see it. You guys see it right there? You might not be able to see it on the camera. Oh shit, okay. Now you can. Made that egg even worse. Okay, but I wanna hold it down because I don't want it to go underneath. Shit. You can see it over here too. You see it right there? Okay, another egg. You can see it right there. Okay, another one. That not so much. I'm gonna be the assistant here. It's not gonna work, but it would be cute if it did work. All right, guys, another thing that I'm noticing is that the eggs are only getting cooked right underneath. Do you see the heat is not coming up into the silicone? How the hell am I gonna flip this? Eggs are gonna go flying everywhere. Like a dum-dum, I put seven eggs on here. <laughs> I just don't wanna flip it too soon and then egg yolk go everywhere. Don't laugh, ready? Oh my God, I can hear you guys saying, no, no, don't flip it. Don't flip it. Ready? One, two, three. Oh gosh, should I close my eyes? I'm so if egg goes everywhere in the kitchen, I swear. One, two, three, go. Flip it. Motherfuckers. <gasps> this is the biggest piece of shit I have ever tried, ever, ever, ever. Did I do it wrong? No. God damn it, you guys. Eggs are Erwer. I thought that was gonna be the one egg that actually survived this. I'm gonna go ahead and just flip it over. See what we got. Look at that. Half of them are on the pan. Half of them are still in here. What a disaster. Don't even tell me in the comments that I did this shit wrong because this is just the biggest fail of the century. I think this product is gonna take worst as seen on television product of 2017. I think we need to go ahead and nominate this guy for that because you're dead to me. It's over. We're breaking up. Look at this disaster. Look at that. What a mess. Fail of the year. I'm gonna go ahead and call it. I know it's too early in 2017, but this might take the cake this year. We'll watch throughout the year to see if anything beats this thing, but I mean, seriously. Let's take a poll. If you own this thing and it is a total disaster, just like you saw in this Vivian Tries video, give this video a thumbs up. If you have this disaster and you think it's flipping fantastic, I want you to give this video a thumbs down. Let's see how many people really love this thing. All right, you guys, that is it for another Vivian Tries video. Thank you so much for coming back week after week. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. I put out one to two videos every week for you. You're either gonna get a redo Wednesday video, 8 a.m. Central Standard Time. Every Saturday, you can expect a Vivian tries. All right, you guys, thank you so much for everyone who joined me on my live stream. That was so much fun. I love talking to you guys, so do not miss the next one. Jot it down. Thursday, March 9th, 8 p.m. Central Standard Time right here on my channel. We can chat live. We can talk about new upcoming episodes. For those who missed the first one, turn on notifications. If you have not turned on notifications, go ahead and turn those on right next to the subscription button. There's a little bell. If you click on that, it will notify you directly on your phone or via email so that you are notified immediately that I start my live stream. All right, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.